was running checklists and watching the weather and watching the traffic and traffic to the runway and wanted to come to the tower and really cool. My runway center line went from this to this. And this is about how cool you look. <laughs> Once I got lined up on center line, I got so fixated that I let go of all those other tasks that we have to do when we're on checklists and engineers. But this is a 1950s trainer jet. Um, and it was flown in the heat of Southwest Texas, and it smells exactly like you would expect a 1950s military vehicle being flown in the heat of Southwest Texas to smell. Christy, I, can, I know it's right there. Yep. <laughs> Studying the technical manuals for this beast, um, which was not made by IKEA. I wish it was that simple, right? But you're studying the technical manuals, which is really a cure for insomnia. And if you're not studying the technical manuals and you're not flying, what you're probably doing is chair flying, which is just fancy pilot speak for visualization, right? <laughs> and keep in mind the multiple role rule. Like, Katie, you have four sons. So we said that the kind of mom you are to my favorite of your son. But you have your you have your Josh's mom. Yes. Uh line. Being a sounding board to an adult child, uh, helping when asked and including family events. So those are some of the things. So those are ideals. I do know that your ideal state <coughs> came with some crosswinds, which in the plane a crosswind is anything that blows you off center line. And in life a crosswind is anything that blows you off center line. Yes? Yes. And we got thrown off course big time. Uh, we got thrown right into the emergency room. So the emergency. So we're going to look at some of the um, things that can pull us off center line. So we're looking just for four things. What are four things, factors of life, that can pull you away from being an ideal student? Is you have all these things going on. So whether it's just cancer, or you've got your day job and your school, and you're factoring in all these other things: time, money, your family responsibilities. Um, in the plane, when we have these crosswinds, we have a counteracting input. So if the wind is coming from the left, you put in a crosswind control of left wing down to counteract the wind. So what we're going to do now with the green lines over here, again for students, is what are some of those counteracting strategies or plans or things we can use to counteract? Like so under each line, what is a coping strategy to get us back towards center? straw proves we're blowing and then you're vocalizing while you're blowing mm -hmm. so the the blowing the small opening here creates the back pressure making sound creates a vocal folds to move so it's <sighs> whenever I do this I literally like just now I go back to talk and everything feels just a little bit better mm -hmm. first thing in the morning um, and you don't have to have the straw to do it though who doesn't have it? that's just a good time rainbow tubes Boys. Thank <laughs> you.